Bionstore.com slash special. Present. Math games for the classroom. Games offer students the opportunity to improve their math skills in a relaxing and fun setting. They may not realize they are learning while playing math games. Many math games can be adapted for different math concepts and grade levels. Math Bingo Create math bingo cards by placing a different number in each square. Pass out bingo cards and markers to each student. Write a math problem on the chalkboard or overhead projector. Ask the students to solve the math problem and search for the answer on their math bingo boards. A marker is placed on the square containing the answer. Repeat with more math problems until someone gets a bingo. Estimation Jars Use a jar filled with objects to improve the estimation skills of students. Fill the jar with one type of object so that all items are the same shape and size. Possible items to use include building blocks, candy corn, rubber balls, or paper clips. Show the students 10 of the objects so they have a basis for their estimation. Based on how 10 of the objects look, students will make an estimation of how many are in the entire jar. Fill the jar with new objects each week. Math Baseball Designate four spots in the classroom as home base, first base, second base and third base. Compile a list of math problems in varying degrees of difficulty. Divide the math problems into four groups based on their difficulty level. The difficulty level will determine on which base the student will land with a correct answer, with the easiest questions earning a run to first base and the most difficult questions earning a home run. Correct answers for the two medium level groups will earn a run to second or third base. Split the students into two groups. Determine which group is up to bat first. Have the first batter select the base she wishes to reach. Give her a math problem associated with that base. A correct answer earns her the position at that base. An incorrect answer is an out. If players are already on the bases, they advance according to the number of bases earned by the batter. Add a point to the team total for each player who makes it back to home base. Switch teams after three outs or once everyone on the first team has had a chance. Math War Use a standard deck of playing cards with the face cards removed. Divide the deck between two students. Determine the operation you wish the students to practice. Addition, subtraction, and multiplication work best for this activity. Division is difficult because not all numbers divide evenly into each other. Each student flips over the top card in her deck. Have the students apply the chosen operation to the two numbers. For example, if you are practicing multiplication, the students should multiply the two numbers that are revealed on their cards. The first person to calculate the correct answer wins that round. Beach Ball Math Use a permanent marker to make squares on a beach ball. Fill each square with a different number. Throw the beach ball to a student. Have the student add, subtract, multiply, or divide the numbers that are beneath each of his thumbs. The difficulty of this activity can be modified by using higher or lower numbers and by changing the operation. Another option is to put an entire math problem in each square. Have the student answer the math problem under a certain finger. Have the student toss the beach ball to one of his classmates after he answers correctly. Thank you for watching my videos. Please check the link below to get the discount.